Hello and welcome back to another quiz corner with Go to Gaming. I forgot my name for a second then, obviously not really my name, but you know, unless that's a very weird birth certificate I have there. Um, but we're back today with a yeah, another quiz. It's slightly different to the last two. I mean, most of them have been general quizzes, stuff like that, answer, having to answer things. This one is just how strong is your vocabulary? So this is an actual kind of intelligence test to a guess to a degree i guess there's 10 questions to find out and maybe learn some new words along the way so let's see if we can do that um there's different versions every time you play it, it's a different version it's done by merriam webster again the link will be in the description below so if you want to have this a go at this yourself um we'll just accept the cookies there get that out of the way you'll have 10 seconds to answer each question the faster you answer the higher score the harder the question the higher your score okay so let's, let's just jump in i guess um vocabulary was yeah, I'm, I'm saying let's jump in and then not jumping in. Um, vocabulary, something that was pretty, I was pretty good at at school to a degree. Now I do chuck in some fancy poncy words every now and then, particularly at work. So if I'm trying to look a bit better than I really am <laughs> necessarily at my job, um, particularly with customers, things like that on the phone. Uh, yeah, chuck in the odd uh, word as I can't think of one really disproving my point. But let's jump in. Let's just right. Okay, which is a synonym of precarious? Precarious means like uh, dangerous, isn't it? It's the closest. Yeah, precarious is like yeah, something at the risk of falling if it's on something's hanging off the side of a shelf. It's precarious or something, isn't it? So this isn't so bad to start with. Which is a synonym of halcyon? Those halcyon days. It's like good days, isn't it? So it must be happy. Yeah. And I for years didn't know how that was pronounced. <laughs> How can how what 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 halcyon? And I've heard I heard someone say it once. I was like, oh, that's what that word is. Okay, we got that. We got there. We got that. That's two out of two. Gregarious. Okay, isn't that? Oh, but you're being a bit gregarious. Isn't that select? Oh, sociable. Okay, I couldn't really think what one that applied to there. I mean, I mean that was quite a high difficulty point. I think so. Manifestation. Right, that's a lot of something, isn't it? Manif or something forming. Um, trouble. Ah, oh, indication. Really? Okay, I'm really starting to. Oh, it's the good start. Really starting to struggle a little bit. Guile. That's like being good at something, isn't it? Or trickery. Yeah. Yeah, that'll do. Got a bit of speed bonus there as well, which is pretty good. Uh, synonym of gas canade. Right, I don't even know what gas canade is. Gas canade. Let's go for a guess. Denial. Boasting. <laughs> I don't know that word. That's a legitimately new one on me. Don't know if that's an American word, if it's an American quiz or what. I don't know. I'm not too sure. It's macabre. That's like somber, deathly, isn't it? And horrifying. Didn't click. Horrifying. Let's get the speed bonus still. Hopefully we do. Yeah, something's macabre. It's like, yeah, like dark and yeah, scary, whatever, isn't it? Um, like a horror film, it can be macabre. Uh, not macabre, uh, which is a synonym of preeminent. Is it preeminent? Preeminent. Pre normally means before. Oh, we jumped in. Did we get that? I think we got it. Did we get the answer? I don't know if we ran out of time. No, I think it just gave the answer. I literally went to click it and it didn't click. Ran out of time. Motif. That's like an emblem or pattern. Yeah, we'll go with that. Got that really quickly in there. So. We've got one more question. Okay, I thought that was the last one. Proving maths isn't my strong point. Uh, ponder. That's to think, isn't it? Consider. Yeah, eight seconds in. That should be a nice bonus as well. So that's all the questions done. This is going to be quite a quick quiz today. I haven't tested any of these or done any of them, so I don't really know. I'm going in a little bit blind to a degree. I, you know, I was hoping at least for a ten-minute quiz, I guess. But let's have a look. What was my result? 1880... <laughs> <laughs> to 4,200. You got 6 out of 10 correct. Average 2,674 2, points. Yeah, you compare with others in your age group, view scores. I mean, there's people that are getting 4,200. Yeah, right, whatever, mate. You've probably done it before. Um, I'm not pessimistic. Uh, pessimistic? That's the wrong word. Well, there we go. That, that explains why my vocabulary answer was wrong. What was the word I was looking for? It's gone out of my head. Um, let's have a view scores. See how it compares. Oh, giving away some detailed information here recently turned 37 so where do I a uh, slightly below the curve I guess I mean there's no curve there it's it's a bar chart but you get what I'm saying so I'm here 
and the average age group is up here somewhere, so not far off from my average age group. Um, I mean, 30 to 40, it's very different. I know, I know a lot more, and I'm a lot more learned. Big word, good word. It, from now, 37, than I was when I was 30. I've learned a lot of things. I've studied a lot more things, taken more in. To be fair, I've forgotten a lot as well. <laughs> it's pushed, it's pushed a lot of stuff in. It was like that time, I took that wine drinking course and forgot how to drive. Just to credit the Simpsons with a gag there, similar that fits in quite nicely. If I can find the clip, I'll squeeze it in, in the edit. Um, but that's going to wrap that up for there. Um, I'll drop the link in the description, like I said before. So if you want to give it a go, feel free. Let me know how you scored, how that compares in your age group. Let me know in the comments down below while you're there. Drop a like on the video as well if you enjoyed it. Drop a sub on the channel if you're new around here as well. That'd be absolutely fantastic. And until next time, well, I guess I'll see you later. Take care.